right guys welcome back to the video and today i have the galaxy note 8 with me here and today finally the android pie updates arrived or also known as the one ui so you can see what's new upgrade the one ui for android pie and this is the file size about 1.9 gigs of storage space needed and you need uh, obviously enough space to upgrade make sure you have a uh, backup of stuff as usual you can see all the change log over here basically it's the new ui uh, revamp that we saw earlier with the galaxy s9 so yeah so here's the uh, new things we're going to get with one ui we have a night mode everything is interactable with one hand which is nice a lot of new features coming as well uh, new uh, emojis as well so i'm going to go through all those in the ui itself once we update our phone so yeah and uh, yeah, let's go ahead and install. So, stop now. So, this is gonna take a while here. I'll be skipping ahead uh, to the part where the phone is done. So, yep, it'll take some time. So, I'm gonna fast forward to where the phone uh, has done updating and then we'll be right back to discuss all the uh, features. Just a quick overview on the update. And, yep, that's pretty much it. So, stay tuned for the next part of the video. See you there. Alright guys, so the phone is still updating. You can see... Oh man, it's too glaring. Let me reduce. Yeah. Optimizing apps, you can see. So now the screen is at the bottom. It's last time it was in the center. It's kind of interesting. So the new one UI, everything is moved to the bottom, which is kind of nice. So yeah, still going on. Uh, just a little bit more until it's done. Alright guys, and we are done. So we are already at the home screen here. Let me just show you guys the lock screen first, uh, how it looks like. So this is the lock screen. Notifications over here it seems, yeah. And um, so let's go to settings and check uh, the, uh, the the build version. So go to about the phone and you can scroll down and see software information. One UI version 1.0, version 9 Android. So let's check it out. Look at this Android Pie. Here you go. And let's go back. And this is the new baseband version, which is the uh, XXU5DSB1. Looks like a new one. And I think the rest are pretty much identical. And you can see the patch level is also updated to 1st February, which is nice. And yeah, so basically the new one UI that you have seen with the S9 is now on the Note 9. Major change in the icons as well. You can see it's the new icons. They give us new icons over here. And the notification tree as well. So you can actually pull down. Let me just try pulling down with... You can put it one hand. Yeah, you can do it. See all the uh, toggles here. A bit different. Mm, we have Dolby Atmos, which is, not, which is interesting. We have Smart View, which is new. Kids Home Night Mode, this is a highlighting feature of the One UI. Uh, let's go to uh, settings again and check something. Uh, display and the night mode. So this will enable system wide dark theme. So if you go, like, say, to the uh, let's say we go to the calculator, it will be oh, it's not black. Hmm. Interesting. How about the calendar? Okay, the calendar is black. So the core system apps are black. Uh, let's try game launcher. Yeah, it's black as well. Mm, how about the... Not sure YouTube. No, YouTube is not a system core app. Sorry. Um, what are the... Yeah, Samsung folder here. Yeah, we can go to the Galaxy Store. Let's check this out. Oh, it's not black. I think not all the apps are black. Only some. How about my files? Yeah, my files is black color. Uh, yeah, it looks like not all the apps. Only the core system apps are uh, night mode. So you can see it's dark. Let's turn it off. Uh, navigation bar toggle that's new. So I think you can turn it off and then it's gone. Then I think. You can use gestures already. Yeah, this is based on gestures. So you can enable the gesture functionality uh, on Android Pie now. If you don't want that, you can just uh, turn it off by tapping this one. 
which will get the navigation bar back but um, this will make the screen look nicer so you can see it's for there's more space down in the down below so you can swipe up to go to the notification uh, not notification so your multitasking tray swipe in the middle to go back home swipe here to go back so pretty straightforward so let's try the new notification tray you can see eh, multitasking tray so these are all the shortcuts i'm not sure you can customize this mm, not sure i think these are the previously used apps yeah close all and this is to go back yeah so pretty like i pretty like the ui actually it's very nice so everything is you can see pretty nice uh, let's see uh, what else oh let's check the camera ui let's, let's go to camera mm, okay oh we are having the new ui which is interesting so this one is what the one found on the galaxy s10 in that was recently launched so now oh uh, yes software updated okay so yeah this is the new ui and uh, they have live focus to the left panorama pro live focus photo video super slow mo everything is actually same it's the only thing changed is the ui bixby vision is up there now so the settings you can see i think it's pretty much identical nothing much has changed in terms of settings it's just the ui is uh, like the uh, one of the s10 so that's nice and yeah so let's see the reminders app oh it's a new one as well everything is new so pretty nice refreshing change here um, for the uh, note 8 but this dolby and most i'm curious to try it out but i we need to actually have headphones to try this out so yeah, guys that's pretty much it for this one ui update with the uh, galaxy note 8 here uh, let me just sh check everything yep every oh we have actually a new button order uh, no. Let's go to the button order. Um, I remember there's one new one. Is there a new one? Oh, I could be wrong. Ah, mistake. Anyway, uh, that's it for this video. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the initial installation and the update for the Galaxy Note 8 here. So we'll be doing a similar kind of video with the Galaxy S8, which also should get the Android One UI update. No. The Samsung One UI update running on Android Pie. So that will be coming very shortly. And yep, stay tuned to my channel for more videos. And peace out.